All right guys, welcome back to another video. We are at Pandora Car Alarm Systems today. He's Ben, I'm Lee. We are Evil GT, that's DPD. And today we're gonna do the RS3. Yeah, there's already a canvas immobiliser, a well-known a well canvas mobiliser system on there. Yeah, we're not gonna naming, say who it is. Naming absolutely no name so we don't get into any trouble. Pandora are gonna try and find it, take it off, and then install theirs and explain to us why theirs is better. <laughs> So we have Mark, aka the Viking, aka the Wizard. I don't know why they call him that, but I'm sure there's a reason. Just because he's got a dead good beard down here, <laughs> we can't we can't grow anything like that. It's, it's quite good. So we've given him, well you've given him a challenge. Yeah, you, I have. You said you're not gonna tell him where the immobiliser. No, I'm not, no. That's not even a mob. What is it? What's the one we've got on it? Canvas? A canvas immobiliser system thing. But there's about from what the installer told us, who spent quite a lot of time actually installing this, but he said there's about five or six different places that they recommend you put it. I've given him a bit of a clue and said it's in between two of those places. So it's not bang on in one, it's in between two. You got it? That's not a clue. Oh, that's it is a clue. I thought you said you got it no, then. We're not that's gonna... a clue, isn't it? Because um, now what I've done clue, is, because yeah. I've, I've, yeah, because that's then still that's in like five different in places. two places of like Germany and England. We have got a bigger problem. What? Well, he's not had breakfast yet. So oh yeah. <laughs> and if he's any, and if he's anything like you, a bit grumpy when you're not eating. So we might have an issue here. It might take him a while because everyone knows if you're hungry, you don't get shit done, do you? No, you don't get anything done. Right. The Viking has yeah. just said yeah. that he's found some different tape. So. So this is where the wizard bit comes in now, right? Well, you'd think so, yeah. He's waving his waving his wand and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> this is our. Did, does anyone know this is our alarm system to get done at Pandora? <laughs> you just got a wizard stick and shit happens. Is that how it is? And they pay all this money. Nothing actually, nothing actually happens, does it? Well, usually it looked like he just hid your key before, so your car definitely couldn't get nicked. My car's not here, mate. This is your key. No, that's what I'm saying. I couldn't find my key. All neither right. <laughs> neither that's could my, my key. No, but the. Yeah, so the tape, can you remember the guy who installed it? Yeah. So we didn't put the video on. We made a video of the of this current system that's in it getting installed, but we couldn't put it on because it was kind of obvious where it was, which defeated the object of it. He showed us loads of different rolls of tape, didn't he? Can you remember? He's like, oh, yeah. they, these use this tape, these use this tape. This is the tape they use in the factory. Yeah. So there's no way that you can tell if you're going to steal it, oh, that tape's different because yeah. it's all the same. I you... just felt it on weird like that. On these, they're uh, not wrapped. The whole way down, you'll, it'll be like separate wraps, separate wraps and stuff. Right. Whereas this has been taped completely all the way up. So oh, it looks like, right, right. But a normal person wouldn't be able to see that. A thief wouldn't be able to see that. Right. It's okay. only because I do these all the time. Okay, so 10 minutes in, where are we up to? We're getting hot. We're getting hot. Right. So found something in the door, yeah? Well, something that you would you would sort of go left or right with thinking that's not factory, that's, you know. Okay. So yeah. Um, right. So anyway, but. I think what we've, we have got to point out is the install, there's been more effort put into this install than you would usually you would usually get. Yeah, so your usual would be Thief with two Fs. Yep. Um, they probably would still be messing about right. trying, to, trying to find it, so. Right. So the main thing is 10 minutes left. <laughs> <laughs> no, you've done well on it. Oh, that's a good sign because when you had it installed, um, you paid your money. Yeah. And at least you know you had a good job. The thing is with this system is, you're not actually changing this, this current system on it because it's bad. No, We're no, just not doing at a video all. to see how long Pandora, you yeah. know, if the wizard lives up to his name. <laughs> <laughs> well, I found it, didn't I, in 10 minutes? <laughs> yeah, you did it. Well, 12, don't let me exaggerate. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah. no, to be fair, yeah, I'll give you that. And you didn't help me saying what's all right, I just came in. No, no, you just went straight in at the... Uh, but the right side, well, he's definitely found it. What yeah. we're giving him, 12 minutes on that, yeah? Roughly? Yeah, 12, 12 and a half okay. minutes, yeah. So we know that nothing was put in the boot. Yeah. You've not even looked in there. Nothing was put on the uh, passenger side. Yeah. Everything was put in there and where he is, yeah. is where we know yeah. it went, right? And you say nine times out of 10, that's where the port driver side. So it's usually in that sort of region where the port. Yeah. Yeah. But what he, what he also did say, what Mark did say, was that it's, it's a really, really good job. It's, it's been really job, well yeah. hidden, yeah, so. So, supposedly, in a couple of minutes, this car is going to start. Is that breakfast, that? Right, so if anybody that watches our YouTube channel wants to donate a bib, <laughs> make sure you get it with Evil GT on, you know? Look off, mate. And we'll even put it, yeah, 
That's it, it's coming off. We'll even put it, we'll right. put it in the evilgt.com store. Thanks mate. So you can buy it for your little... Why you know, didn't you notice that before? Do you know right? the ones that are like, um, do you know the little, the little baby, baby ages, like six months old? That yep. need the bibs. Ironically though, that's because I'm young. You're gonna need a bib because you're getting old and you trickle <laughs> down your chin. <laughs> Look how fluffy this is. I one, know. You know. That's the, bits on it. that's the Evil GT hoodies. It's been washed about three times as well and it's still getting fluff on me. What's so up here? When we was in Dubai, oh, yeah. Remember you, this, yeah. you were there for that long. You I needed to clothes, start right? buying clothes, yeah. So you had to buy something, you got the car, didn't you? Yeah, I did, yeah. Oh, yeah that's that's right. Thanks, mate. One wire of this generic immobiliser system has been snipped. Yep. And if Mark's right, the car now should start. So it should go off now. Yeah, there you go. And it stays on. And it stays on. So Mark, the wizard, aka the Viking, yeah. has found <laughs> the system, the little bit. This is the only bit we can show. And that is it. That is all you're getting. So that bit was snipped and then yeah. the car started. There's other bits to it, but that's the only, just so we don't get in trouble, that is the only bit we can show. That's it, that's all you're getting. There you go, hold on. Red wire, surely, surely all the other systems have a red wire. So there's no possible way any companies can get on getting upset same no. with bad mouthing their products. No, because there's got to be loads of other thingies that use a red wire like that, no, surely. It is one red wire. That is it. <laughs> the new one, the Pandora one, is yeah. ready to go on. What are we, what are you getting on it? It's just, it's just, it, well, I don't know, actually, is the only answer to that. I have right. no idea. Okay, cut. Right, Mark, do you know what thing's going on it? Yeah, you're going to get two physical cut immobilizers. Okay. So if you do find the alarm brain and pull it out, it still won't start. Okay, sounds good. I think that's good. I Two mean, sounds I, better than one, right? You think so? Oh, yeah, yeah but they're physical cuts. Where oh. Sorry. It's all right. I'll, I'll, uh, <laughs> I'll cut that out. Whereas the other one, um, you can add a physical cut on, but most people don't anymore. They just rely on cam blocking. So when you do find it and put it out, the car just starts. Right. So what you're saying is the one you're going to put on, even if you pulled it out, still and found won't. it, still yeah. won't start. No. Right. So now, after the destruction of the. <laughs> Immobiliser, canvas immobiliser thing that we can't show you on camera, that one. Yeah. Uh, it's getting put back together. But we can't show you this bit. After this. Oh no, after this, yeah. Because yeah. that's going to be then be the installation of the Pandora, which takes a few hours. So okay. this is, this is you, this, this is an impression of, the only problem is now we need to get you a one-handed zimmer so you can hold the camera in the other hand. <laughs> that's how it's going to have to go. Are you taking a piss out of my age? Would I do that to you? When's your bus pass coming? So we've got Matt here from Pandora. In regards to the system that was in it, the canvas immobiliser system, how does the one that you've now just put in it, how does that differ to what was in it before? So a canvas immobiliser system, typically these work digitally. Yeah. So what happens is it will send a code which in turn inhibits other codes that the vehicle uses to, for instance, start the vehicle. Yep. So by that basically, it sends a code and that basically it will like, um, for instance, stop the vehicle going into gear or to prevent the ignition turning on or prevent the car from turning over, that kind of thing. Our system, although it can use canvas modelization and digital modelization, we prioritize what's called physical normally open relays. Essentially, um, in layman's terms, even if you remove the system, the vehicle is still immobilized. The only way to bypass a normally open physical immobilizer is to find it and rewire it. So that's okay. essentially the main difference. In terms of security, a canvas immobilizer uses the code, it's digital, ours is physical, you have to physically find that and take it out in order to bypass it. There's no digital bypass method. And there's more than one. So even if you yeah. were to physically find that, that Pandora little thing that I got before, even if you were to find that and chop it out, it still wouldn't start. Exactly that. And so that's, that's because there's something else somewhere in the car. Exactly that. that. Don't know, I, don't even know where, I don't even know where any of the bits are, <laughs> do you? I have no idea. That's the actual alarm brain. It's the size of a USB stick. This can have all the sensors built in. It controls the immobilization, hands-free arming, disarming, Bluetooth. That it's, it's ridiculously tiny. Again, trying to find that in a vehicle, it's not going to happen, and that has so much built into it. The tag itself is pretty much the same size. This is the little Bluetooth tag. Personally, I usually keep mine on with my house keys. As long as it's separate from the key tags, it offers the most protection. That's one way of using the vehicle. You could, in theory, use your mobile phone as a Bluetooth encrypted tag as well, all encrypted by 120 bit encryption. So you can use a tag, you can use a smartphone as an encrypted tag. Preferably or an Android, you said, didn't you? Preferably. Preferably you can still use an iOS device, yeah. you have to open the app first and then it's seen as a tag. Okay. So with, with Android, you don't have to open the app, it's just always seen as a tag so it works okay. a bit more conveniently in that sense. Yeah. Um, alternatively, you can use a validation sequence like you know, press, press, press on the steering wheel yeah. and that will disarm the system or a combination of the two, so tag, validator, phone, validator, that kind of thing. This is obviously the base system, this is the Pandora Storm. That's it, yeah. Um, so this is 
400 pounds is this retail pound fitted, yeah. um what was quite clever about this was that you can add the features to your more expensive range we're really proud of that when we made this system we made it to be basically the strongest mobile system on the market today but also the most upgradable yeah. so because it uses the same hardware as one of our alarm systems it's compatible with the alarm system upgrade so you can, you can add the siren add the sensors make an alarm system in the future if you change your mind you can add the tracking the the call text and push phone notifications to your mobile device or the ability to track the vehicle obviously to control it anywhere in the world that's all added on at a later date that you, that's upgradable or even things like remote start so if you did want to remote start your car it's again a fully upgradable yeah. and within the pandora ecosphere um, you can add any feature we offer basically to the storm. Try now, Ben. No. Yeah. Job done. It's not going to go through that shutter. It's not going to go through your door, right? No, but worst case, you can alter the distance in the app anyway. So if you think yeah. that it's if you're not confident with the distance of it, you can have it so it needs to be slightly close to the car, whatever. You can alter it anyway. Yeah. How would you sell? your system. The cameras mobilizers, they do work, they do the job. However, do they do it as effectively? No. And ultimately, any installer will definitely tell you that normally open physical mobilization is the gold standard. It's always going to be the strongest. Now, here's the thing. It takes a lot more experience and time to fit. So it's, there's always going to be less people that can do that, but it's always going to be kind of the top dog. So essentially, as opposed to having one digital mobilizer, you're having two physical mobilizers that essentially the only way to get past them is to literally not just remove the unit and then a car starts, you can't, that won't work. Obviously you have to find the immobilizer and rewire it. And again, taking apart the car, that's not a quick process. No. Not only is it the actual immobilization that's more secure, there's more features. The phone app gives you like battery you know, status information so you don't have to you know, keep checking your battery, you know it's gonna go dead. You can check the battery in your tag so you can put it into service mode to hand it back into Audi for instance, arm this on the system, change, sense, change how the app looks. It's just more gadgety, which is, Kind of what we want nowadays. It's a bit of me, that. That's a bit of me. I love <laughs> gadgets, don't I? You love the app. If you get an app with anything, ESO. <laughs> <laughs> this is obviously the Pandora app. You've got the battery voltage, you've got the fuel levels. It's showing the stats and the information of the car. So it's currently armed. Um, you can obviously show it's in park, it's automatic. The internal temperature is 17 degrees. Here we've got the arm disarm commands and other features we can add in. This little tag here, if I cl click that, we can see that there's two tags paired to the system. The first one in the inner circle is close enough to drive the car. Okay. And if we click onto that, this is what I was on about earlier. It will show you the firmware, the battery voltage. This one in the second circle means it can see the tag, but it's not set because we changed the distance of the tag to be closer. It's not close enough to drive the vehicle. Okay. So obviously it's another part of the room where it's not close enough. Um, and if there's anything out in the, in the final circle, the third circle, that will show us red. It means it's either not got a battery in it or it's just not seen by the system, it's too far away. Okay. So that's quite useful to have. Yeah, um, definitely. Just to see and just test really. No doubt my missus will lose this at some yeah. point, but you get this card, okay. which on the back of it has a hidden little code. Yeah, like with, a scratch, like you're doing a lottery. Yeah, yeah. scratch card. There's a switch inside that you have to, so say if this is like 1111, you have to press it, one beep, one beep, one beep. So it's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. This then resets it and you can get in and start it at least and then job done. Cheers, Mark. Thanks, mate. Thanks, mate. Gandalf Cheers. without the grey. Mark, the Vikings. That's another new name that I've got to add now. Gandalf without the grey, I think that's pretty good. You did a good job. 12 minutes. But to anyone, what, you know what editing's like. It really took you an hour and 12 minutes. <laughs> no, we <it> didn't. <laughs> you just started Instagram, right? Yeah. Do you want some uh, followers? <laughs> <laughs> well, what's your what's your Instagram? <laughs> Mark the Viking Wizard. Mark there you go. Underscore the underscore Viking underscore Wizard. Yeah, that's it. You'll be there on you a million by tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> We're not even on that. Thank you very Cheers, much. Guys. See you later. See you later. Thanks. Thanks. Okay. In a bit. So that's it. Thanks again to Mark, Mark, the Wizard, and the Viking. Hey, for... I'm not going there again. He takes the piss out of me more than you do. Do you know what? I should wish I would have got that on camera. He's calling him all kinds of names. What? What a guy, yeah. Hi, he's my, bastard. He's my mate already. <laughs> so we're going to be back at some point. But in the meantime, hit the subscribe button and follow us on Instagram if you can be bothered, to be fair. Just, no, just, you obviously can be bothered. Just do it, please. Do Thanks. whatever you want. Thanks. You know, it's up to you, and it? It's your finger hitting the button. See you on the next video. And uh, we've got two hours going home now with him piping on about his, uh, his new... The new Pandora's. New Pandora system. So, yeah, see you in a bit. Thanks for coming.